Hello, I'm Horacio El Negro Hernandez, here from the headquarters of HQ, the makers of the great real field practice pad. And now we're just going to stretch this concept of, of the club in 4-4 four, four and 6-8. Instead of playing the whole subdivision of 4-4 four, four and the whole subdivision of 6-8, we're going to play half of the, of the <coughs> bar in 4-4 four, four and the second half in 6-8. So bar uh, beats 1 and 2 are going to be in 4-4 four, four, and beats 3 and 4 in 6-8. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, And then we're going to stretch it even more. <coughs> so we're going to play each beat in a different signature, let's call it. We will play beat 1 in 4-4, four, four, beat 2 in 6-8, beat 3 in 4-4, four, four, and the last one in 6-8 again. 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, We have played all these exercise, exercises actually starting <coughs> with the 4-4 four, four signature, but it's also uh, useful to practice them starting with the 6-A subdivision. So <coughs> instead of starting with the 4, we'll be on the 6-A, right? 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, Another <coughs> useful tools or exercises uh, to, to understand the clave and to understand the, the rhythmic modulations of the clave, <coughs> another very good way is to adapt the rudiments to the rhythm of the clave. For example, we have the three stroke rough, one, two, three. And then we're gonna put that into clave. One, two, three, four. Same <coughs> to the to the drag. For example, the fourth stroke rough also can be used. Five stroke rolls, six stroke rolls. And that way, <coughs> we get to practice all the rudiments also using the rhythm of the clave. Enjoy it and use your practice pad. <coughs>